Well, I like seeing the live shot too because you saw the fine mist. It was more of like a mm -hmm. very light rain. Yeah. I'm not saying there's no snow, but let me tell you, it, it is not like a, a snow event out there at all, as predicted. Uh, you know, I got to give uh, kudos to the team this last week because they kept saying it's going to be kind of a cold rain and might change over to a little bit of light snow later in the evening. And that's kind of what we're seeing now. Metro area has just been mostly uh, a rainfall. Yeah, you had snowflakes mixed in at times, a little bit of snow, then back to rain. That's how it's been here. You go farther north, it is the light snow and all the way up to the state line. And that's where the bulk of your accumulation is going to be. And what accumulation you're going to get is also very minor. So this will continue for the next few hours. It is going to change over to all light snow for everyone probably a little after midnight uh, but like i said not much accumulation when you wake up tomorrow morning streets are wet on the plaza beautiful lights of course i'm so glad they're leaving that on through mid-february i just love the site 37 degrees there's a little bit of light rain a little bit of snowflakes mixed in our wind chill at 32 wind speeds about about seven miles an hour not much change we look at old at 35 degrees with the downtown kansas city lee summit you're down to 34 in liberty missouri down to 34 the wind chill factor in the upper 20s not much change here when you look at it, it's all 30s and all of them above the freezing point i see a, a few 32s and that's about as low as we get. And then Hiawatha at 31, you're going to get that little bit of light snow. But again, as great as the road crews are and treating the roadways, uh, things should be rather nice and quiet. Just take it slowly out there uh, for the evening and for tomorrow morning. As of right now, though, mixed uh, snow and clouds and rain. You see it all together there. Not seeing any clearing skies anytime soon. Quite a bit of snowfall stretching all the way back to Hayes, Kansas. And that whole thing is going to move east, northeast direction. If you are going to be heading out, that's why we have the impact because it's kind of a little bit of fog out there, a little bit of a light rain and snow mixed in. Temperature slowly, and I mean very slowly, dropping down to 33 right before midnight. Overnight, we dropped to only about the upper 20s to 30. This is future scam. Moderate snowfall, just a little burst of it later on this evening. Then it just kind of falls into the light snow category. And most of it again north, especially north of Missouri River, and you get to like the St. Joseph Chillicothe northward, and that's where your minor accumulation is going to be. A lot of cloudiness tomorrow. Don't expect a lot of sunshine when you get up and go to uh, to your activities or church or wherever tomorrow. And this is what you're going to see on the ground. Maybe an inch and a half at most for St. Joseph. Pockets of maybe an inch and a half to two inches. A lot of that will be grassy areas. And when you get to the metro area, again, mostly grassy areas. And those of you like in Clinton, Butler, sorry, you're not going to get any uh, snowfall, it seems like, on accumulation wise on the ground. Tomorrow afternoon, 36 degrees. Might get a little bit peak of sunshine, but overall, overcast skies and wind speeds about five to 10 miles an hour. And on the nine day forecast, the pick day for early next week will be Monday if you want a nice Decent day with a high of 40. That's going to be Monday afternoon, but then we're looking at our chance of snow returning. This will be after 9 o'clock Tuesday night into Wednesday morning. The bulk of that chance will be in the early morning hours on Wednesday with a high of 32 that day. We'll keep an eye on that. If you don't have the first alert and KNBC app, download it. We'll keep you updated on that or right here at Channel 9. And by end of next week, temperatures mid to upper 30s, overnight lows in the upper teens to low 20s.